I'm not sure how many people actually do know what's going into making a VTuber model, so let me break it down for you real fast. It involves the overlap of tons of different skills, starting with the art. You have to make 2D art and separate it into dozens, sometimes hundreds of layers. For example, here's what my eyes look like when they're separated out. These all have to be on their own layers, and then those are converted into something called art mesh in Live 2D. The art mesh will have all of these vertices, and you drag those vertices using a brush tool or a control box called a deformer. And you set up key points or key forms, which represent individual points on a model's movement. And and the software will actually interpolate in between those key forms. So for example, for something like an eye movement, you would have an eye open key form, an eye half open key form, and then an eyes closed key form. And the program will do the in-between for you. The number values on the parameter are then translated into tracking input from apps like Vitamins, VBridger, or even just VTube Studio. And that controls the exported model's movement to sync up. It's an extremely tedious and detail-oriented process that sometimes takes hundreds of hours to finish between the art and rigging. So the next time you see a cool feature on a model, just know that a ton of time and love went into every single detail.